Hello, dear student. Uh, today our topic is on the Aryans. Uh, Aryans uh, in Aryans, uh, where you will learn about uh, uh, the origin of the Aryans and the structure of the Aryan societies and their caste systems. These uh, we will discuss in today's lecture. So over here, if uh, we come to when was the origin uh, and where from where they migrate, they were actually the Aryans were a nomad peoples where they they come from uh, the vast grassland of Central Asia. They were fierce uh, then means much more dangerous in the warriors as compared to the Dravians and they were using of weapons of browns as well they were uh, different they with uh, uh, chariots they were fighting with the chariots um, uh, Aryans were uh, the warriors and they were uh, war uh, with uh, the uh, weapons so they actually come from the uh, here in uh, subcontinent northwestern side they entered in subcontinent then they gradually cover till to uh, right, right now in bangladesh it the mostly the northern part the aryans captured the northern part and what was the origin of that hinduism as actually started of that aryans and they were um, uh, covered mostly in the northern part of the uh, that uh, subcontinent so then what happened when they settled over here they start a different uh, caste system uh, brahmis uh, kshetriyas and vishya and shudras these were the three caste system in the first the priest and academics were considered to be then they were saying the warriors and kings and then the merchants and landowners and the down one was of shudras as commons or the servants then those who were out of cause uh, out of their aryan caste they were uh, uh, living uh, outside of uh, that city and they were doing uh, uh, street sweeping and this cleaning and outcast they were also uh, not giving any their caste system was according to that then what was their language language was of sanskrit then uh, it was also the considered to be one of the oldest uh, language uh, of uh, the world then uh, uh, the Aryans were around 300 years and it is still based on the Hindu religions that mostly the Sanskrit languages are used in the Hindu language and it is uh, also importance not only of uh, Hindu language it is also used in uh, Latin language Sanskrit language also used in Latin French and English some of the words were originated Sanskrit uh, in, in the English words they are originated from Sanskrit so uh, the uh, poetry type which the collections of their prayers were called a uh, vidas these were the vidas this was uh, called uh, one of the uh, part of that aryan so uh, this was the aryans and mostly in the starting they were uh, thinking the aryans were thinking the nature's sign of nature is considered to be the god like they were saying moon is god rivers considered to be because that was the powerful they think that god is powerful so they uh, start praying of their things of the nature such as uh, moon river fire and the earth so then gradually they make according to that sense which uh, right now we can also see the same examples uh, we find in Hindu language and Hindu culture. The Aryas were actually the modern Hindus which we find in mostly part of uh, India. Uh, before we discussed about Hindus were also captured like in Ganges river around the Ganges they settled over there and then they captured uh, that areas and right now the modern Hindus were considered to be uh, the they are the actual the Aryans. So these were the languages and these were uh, of the uh, uh, Sanskrit were their uh, language. So thank you so much for listening to me.